raw. Man glided. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back to Chatterbox, and we are here to do another trailer reaction. I am here with P, Dugs, and Sean. I am the ladies' love, Andre, and we are here to react to Mumbai Saga, directed by Sanjay Gupta, starring John Abraham, Emran Hashmi, and Sunil Shetty. The movie is set in the 80s and 90s and is a story of John Abrams' Don and Embran Hashmi's cop who are caught up in a cat and mouse game in a city whose identity is all about to change. Mm, interesting. Should we take a look? Mm. Where, where is that? Mobile. Oh, okay. He just got dragged for all over the floor. Drake. Absolutely. Is that Rocky? Is that Rocky? He looks like old. He looks old now. It does look like him. Yeah, yeah, it does. Yeah, yeah. Still looks like he's been at the gym, though. Yeah. Man, he looks hench. Mm. Oh, my boy. Oh, my God. I don't know what he said, but he meant it. He meant it. Time to Time to That guy looks like Rocky's nemesis. Bandu to self shock in the Open to sandals. Don't mess with me. Open to sandals. It is really the attire. You see the attire. कैदान ने गायतुंडे से हाथ मिला लिया कैदान का उड़ना बंद कर गायतुंडे अपने आप जमीन पर आ जाएगा चलती रेस में घोड़ा नहीं बनता घोड़ों के रेस में घाटे पर दाब लगाए तूने तेरी गाड़ी बुलेट प्रूफ है आई लाइक दैट ग्रिटी फील दैट इट गिव्स सवाल ये नहीं कि अमरत्या मरेगा सवाल ये है कि 10 करोड़ का मैं करूंगा क्या उस चूहे को बोलो बिल से बाहर निकलने को वाह धोखे की खासियत मैं ग्लाइड से कोई खास ये अर्जुन को जो हुआ उसके बाद अब अमर को कोई नहीं रोक सकता डिड ही टेक अस लॉन्ग टू फूल माय डिड Oh, here we go. Hey, this guy looks so cool, man. He does. He's out the road like a machine. He does. जिस दिन किस्मत ने आपका साथ दिया और आपने उस प्लेयर को मारा तब कम से कम मैं बोल सकूंगा कि मैंने मौत से हाथ मिलाया था हैंसन I just, I was, I felt a little bit cheated seeing him with a gun. I just wanted him to do everything hand to hand mm. and just go around beating up everybody. I just, you know, I was like, take that gun out of his hand because I know he can break that guy's neck with his toenails. <laughs> so I was just like, I want more. I'm more, I'm more. Maybe because I've seen him in other characters, I'm like, yeah, that looks good, but I know he can do better. I know he can do better. That's, yeah, yeah, that's interesting. Um. For a trailer, I'm fine with it. I did. I got. I got enough action. If they give me enough, I'm intrigued to watch the movie to see yeah. what happens. And if they give me more in a movie, if they're hiding stuff, which I like when they do that, 
don't give me everything in the trailer, which Fast and the Furious has done a lot, lots of times, especially that last one with The Rock and Jason Statham. Anyway, back to this. This is, yeah, it looks good. He is very charismatic, very charismatic, and he keeps me engaged in the trailer, and he makes me want to watch the movie, and I like that it's set in the 80s and 90s as well, so that has me interested as well. So, yeah, it wasn't the best trailer in the world, but I'm interested. Yeah, I, I I like the guy who who um you know Rocky who played Rocky Handsome. Um, I think he's great in everything that he does so far that I've seen. So for me, yeah, like Andre said, nothing special, but it's enough to make me want to watch it. Agreed. I would say the same. I really enjoy him. I enjoy his performance. Um, you want him to do what he does. He's one of those actors. It's not, I want to see him in a range of different things. I don't, actually. I think I'd find it really, really weird if I saw him in a romance film and it was serious. I'd be like, can you not? Can you just, like... Can you break her neck? Yeah, can you just, like, slit someone's throat? Like, you need to do something, Violet. That's what he's there for. And I think he brings that. Um, the over-the-top ways of people getting dismantled and dying, again... It's what I want from the film. I want to see some guy skid backwards on the back of his head because he just got kicked in the stomach. Like, I want that from this film. Um, it's shot beautifully. It's so interesting how just the cinematography alone could sell the film. Like, just how it's shot, um, it makes you interested. And exactly what Andre said at the beginning, you gave me enough. I didn't want to know all about the villain. You introduced him to me. And the way they introduced him was, you know, they had that shot with him face went into focus so already i'm like who is this guy and then he says like two words so you know that he's a villain and you see him a little bit but you don't see a lot of him really good strategy definitely interesting um it sounds like we're all interested like even if we're not like super hyped we're interested at least so what do you guys think are you interested in watching give us your thoughts comments like subscribe also remember to subscribe we really appreciate it. We do. Thank you very much. Yeah, that's been our reaction to Mumbai Saga. We'll see you very, very soon. Take care.